The following was posted by Medusa on April 29th, 2016, who gave permission for it to be used here. Many people enjoy drinking alcohol. Some people enjoy it too much. But when does it become alcoholism? With some people, it starts off as a daily enjoyment, then it becomes a habit, and then it becomes an addiction. This addiction is called alcoholism, whereby the person becomes an alcoholic. When I was a child, I thought that alcoholics were the bums that lived under the bridge, in the park, or wherever they could find. Unfortunately, this is not the case. Some of the people suffering from the disease called alcoholism, yes, disease, are everyday people holding down jobs, supporting families, etc. Your priest, your pastor, your father, your mother, your sister or brother, your child's teacher, or even your doctor. This is the harsh reality of alcoholism. If you have the potential to become an addict, it chooses you. Of course, you have to be exposed. The drinking of the alcoholic affects every member of his or her family. The children and spouse of the alcoholic adapt certain patterns of behaviour so they are able to cope with life. They cover up the fact that there is a drinker in their family. They do a lot of things, knowingly or otherwise, to help the alcoholic keep on drinking. This act of enabling creates certain character defects in themselves. When the alcoholic admits they have a serious problem, there is a program they can attend to help themselves, the well-known AA, Alcoholics Anonymous. For the relatives and friends of an alcoholic, there is another program they can attend called Al-Anon. As with many things in our lives, people cannot deal with a so-called problem unless they admit they have a problem. A number of people I know have been living in complete misery because their lives have been affected by relatives drinking alcohol. I was over 70 when I realised I had certain character defects which I had used all my life to protect myself from being hurt by people. I learned as an adult that I was a child of an alcoholic. One of my main character defects was that I thought I was in control of everything and that everyone was my responsibility. I soon learnt that I was not in control of anyone and was not responsible for everyone. The only person I can change the behaviour of is myself. I was fortunate to discover Al-Anon two years ago. I've been attending a group since then and have learnt plenty of tools to help me have a better life. I'm willing to continue learning more skills to help myself. Remember, you are not alone and there is always hope.